Okay, so this is going to be my first tutorial. So I'm just going to hop straight into this. The software I use is Final Cut Pro X. I've been using it for about two to three years. So first off, I'm just going to show you guys how I edit my videos. So you're going to start off by dragging your clip onto the timeline. Next, you're just going to drag your music into the timeline and put it below the video clip. So what I do is I listen to the music and I find out where the screen pumps are going to be or where to add speed ramps and I go into depth about what exactly that looks like on the video and the commands and all that stuff um, pretty much I just listen to it the media music play and I'm just seeing where to make my cuts and where my next sequences are going to be um, so right here this is where I'm going to make a speed ramp which can be easily done by pressing command B so I know I didn't show you guys a lot but pretty much right here you do the speed ramps enough and like I said since the video clip is already in slow motion um, you, just, you go from fast the video is already just going slow so it goes fast to slow to fast to slow and that's really good because if you have a song that's high tempo there's like the words are going fast and there's like a little spacings and the flow in the song it helps flow with the music and I'll show you guys a quick Example of one of my videos with speed ramps in it. Alright, next, I'm just gonna show you guys a quick flow of uh, how to do a flicker effect, which is good because sometimes songs will have a little flicker sound, and I'll show you what that looks like. On the road. <laughs> Riding with the top down, yeah. I'm with my shorty, she gon' drop down the road. Ay, ay. Riding with the top down, yeah. Your first ground is just start, you listen to music and you'll see where the song starts making this little sequence of noises. And you'll start cutting it up. So after you're done cutting it up, you're then gonna, what I do is I go in there and I, I block out certain clips. In a, in a pattern so that way when the playback head goes back over it it ends up making a flicker clip uh flickering clip and here's what it looks like all right y'all um i'm gonna show you guys part two of this video if you I know this wasn't really in depth or really planned out at all. This is like I said, it's my first one, and I'm really just honestly recording off my phone <laughs> for the audio, and then just sending it to myself and put it onto the timeline as we speak. Um, so this is kind of hard. Um, like I said, I know this is just showing you guys a basic idea of what I end up doing. Um, a lot of these videos take about three to five hours to edit maybe longer, maybe eight. Um, it just depends on how long I'm editing to the music. Um, but most of the time I just spread out, spread it out so it doesn't take too long. And a lot of it is just memorizing the hotkeys and once you do that, you can probably make the edit within at least an hour, two hours and a half, at least I can. So if you guys wanna see another part of this video and a better tutorial obviously because this is not that good comment down below uh, on what tutorial you want to see to one of my videos and I'll just I'll do it um, so thank you guys for watching um, thanks yeah, yeah. on the road ay, ay. riding with the top down yeah I'm with my shorty she gonna drop down yeah I'm on a high I'm feeling way up yeah Looking laced up, yeah. We live in facts, and I know some people probably acting fake right now. We could give a fuck about what.